afternoon, amigos, from Monterrey. Monterrey. <laughs> Wait. A very good afternoon, amigos, from Monterrey. And actually, today we are exploring the San Pedro Garza Garcia area. Now, last time we were in Monterrey, you guys told us we had to stay over here, had to at least come to this area. And uh, well, today we see why. This area is. Ooh, lujoso, eh? Yeah. Very fancy. <laughs> This area is so rich that even in the mall, they have a place called Fresa. Mexico really goes all out on the malls, doesn't it? Yeah. This place is, uh, I mean, I say this place, is like every mall in Mexico, really. This is pretty much the standard. Rolex, Palacio de Hierro, I mean, that's everywhere, but it's fancy. Right in. <laughs> uh, but okay, so today we're pretty much just uh, we have some time to kill here in Monterrey. We have fallen in love with the natural beauty of, yeah. of Nuevo Leon. And uh, last time we were in Monterrey, we did not come over here to San San Pedro Garza Garcia. I love that name of the city. Yeah. But now <laughs> it's time to explore our second favorite part of Mexico, malls. <laughs> oh gosh, we do way too much stuff in malls. I, I don't really, I don't really like malls all that much. But I think today we're gonna try and get some tacos. We're gonna walk, uh -huh. uh, explore this area. We're gonna try and show you what it looks like. And Monterrey is uh, very, there's so many new buildings, so many new skyscrapers. Yeah. It's, uh, I don't know if modern, it's modern, luxurious. I don't know. Modern is an understatement. The, it's like, I feel like it's like cutting edge architecture. The yes. malls are like very design, like, I don't even know how to say, like cutting Just, edge design. I feel like that sounds like a commercial, but I really do feel like the malls are like, <laughs> This video is brought to you by the city of Monterrey. <laughs> like cutting edge, like really modern, but funky edge. Are we just walking in circles? Yes, <laughs> there's the escalator. <laughs> well, much like the uh, modern neighborhood of Santa Fe in Mexico City, it's uh, not very walkable. No, it's not very walkable at all. Monterrey, much like, I don't know, more similar to cities in the States, is definitely a place where you have a car to explore. Yeah. Because there's like pockets of areas that you go to, and uh, we're like the only people walking. Yeah. architecture that's really hard cutting edge architecture here in Monterrey and I feel like these are shipping containers that Greg and I watched a show about how people are creating homes and businesses out of these things this is what I'm talking about when I say cutting edge okay in two words or less <laughs> no okay how would you how would you describe Monterrey slash just the San, uh, San, Pedro, San Pedro Garza Garcia area. Confusingly awesome. How so? I think um, there's so much new construction. Uh -huh. yet the street we just walked on had a lot of um, like older homes that were mm -hmm. super, super Very nice. nice. Yeah. I feel like it's a mix between, uh, and Chipinque near there. Yes, there were a lot it's really of, nice. A lot of older homes uh -huh. that were just like mansions. And we say older as in probably from like the 50s, not older in like typical Mexican terms from like yeah. the 1700s. Yeah. But then I think there's so much new modern construction that it's a pretty cool mix. I think I would describe Monterrey or this area as like, a few things come to mind, rather. I, I've seen a lot of luxury cars, I've seen a lot of Audis, yeah. I've seen a lot of uh, BMWs, Porsches. Porsche, yeah, I mean, there's a Porsche dealership close by. Um, I would say shopping. There's a ton of shopping. I mean, there's like three or four malls just kind of close around us here. That's why we're moving! <laughs> <laughs> uh, 
I would say driving, you 100% have to drive. Yeah. Uh, and no all matter where bubble wrap when you walk. <laughs> like, there's a lot of shopping in Mexico City, but uh, you can walk to it all. Whereas here, it's interesting. It's like being back in the States in the sense of, like, there's so many more parking lots. Yeah, a lot of and, those, like, strip centers. A ton of strip centers. That's what I would say. Monterrey. Monterrey strip centers. Yeah. I hope that translates well. <laughs> Wait. <laughs> found ourselves in another mall. How'd that happen? Brooks Brothers, Kate Spade, uh, what is that one back there? Uh, oh, the North Face. I can't even say something. I can't. I, I, you have to be able to speak Italian. Coach. <laughs> uh, Old Navy, that's not too crazy guess, but yeah. I mean, yeah, I don't want to start anything too political, but we've talked about a lot off camera how like the economy must be doing really 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 well right like i mean if people are coming to something called starbucks reserve, reserve what the never even heard okay of. hold on what the hell is this coffee so I don't know how much that's saying but and it's like 22 pesos or less, or less. But there's not even you can get any size for 20. it's really cool that uh, this area is like rich enough to have a star a Starbucks reserve Starbucks reserve the but coffee it makes you walk like this after <laughs> you have it <laughs> but it's hard not to feel a little disgusted I can't take it anymore. Malls, fancy cars, shopping, driving, 80 peso coffee. I feel like I need something to bring me back down to earth. Yeah, me too. fanciness that is San Pedro Garza Garcia. We uh, we had to get back down to a normal level. We were at Taqueria Orinoco, and this is the original Taqueria Orinoco. I believe the, uh, we did go to one in Mexico City. I don't think that ended up in a video, though. Uh, and uh, you know me, I like Las Gringas. This thing is huge, huge with a capital H. Ate all of if yours. I'm being honest, I didn't. I couldn't. There's just one, one little bite and I can't do it. And he goes, I think that's all we have. We had an absolute blast this trip in Monterrey. Last time we struggled to find our groove, but now with a little bit more insight from oh, we found it. you guys, we found, it, we all found right. our groove here in Monterrey. This area close to Taqueria Orinoco was a bit more flavorful, if you will. Lots of restaurants, lots of music. Um, this seems more like the Mexico that Greg and I are used to in Central Mexico. What the? Uh, 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 uh. <laughs> flavorful. <laughs> Our sponsors of this video, today's patrons of the day, Ricardo, Ricardo Duenas, and Mary Howard. Thank you to you two as well as all of our other patrons and you guys for watching that video, this video, that video, whatever. Every video. video. Thank you guys so much. And until next time, have less.
do more, eat more.